Okay, so then I am back again, I guess. So let's see what the portal tree means. Portal tree? What does that mean? Portal trees are trees with roots that reach deep into the fabric of reality. So oh. deeply that they exist in more than one place and time, creating magical connections. Some use these connections to move back and forth among the worlds. As do we tree walkers. But how do you use it? But how do you use a portal tree? This is where magic begins. Oh. What? Wow. You crack it open? Go through the portal, Jerry. From now on, casting magic and wandering between worlds will be an important part of your life. Isn't it dangerous? I mean... Hey! Whoa! <laughs> you jumped before you got the response. Four. Four nails. What? We must hurry. We shall ride the wind. Um. As we have always done. What is going on here? <laughs> so you have always ridden the wind. Now this tree cracked as well. Hey! Whoa! This looks like, like a bigger version of this place. And there's a spider instead of a frog. This still looks like the woods we have back at home. Wait, what's that in the water? The shining pebble. Here we are. Or marble. There's one on the branch as well. What is this? Is it a little cat well, or something? With, with a backpack. The farther we go from the portal, oh, it's a mouse. Clearly, you will come to realize that we have left the world you know far behind us. Only the parallels here at the portal tree suggest a connection. Such as this wall. Follow me, Jeremiah Hazelnut. Oh. What? This guy in his hair. Um. What just happened? I had no idea what happened. I promised you magic. Another world. Before you, Jerry, lies Mousewood. Wow! <laughs> the squirrel is still here. Here you will complete your trip. Uh, there's one of those marbles here as well. But where's the school? And, and all the teachers' nights? This world is very magical. Its trees send their roots deep into the earth and create connections like the one we use to get here. This world will be your school, and its inhabitants will teach you many things. This place may seem unusual to you, but soon it will be an important part of your life. Then, once your training is complete, you will see the world with the eyes of a tree walker. So follow me, young hazelnut. <laughs> Oh, wait, wait! There was a squirrel riding that line. <laughs> oh, down there now. What? How did they get down there? And what's that mouse doing? I know this must doing? still be overwhelming to you, but I need a moment. Just wait here, I'll be right back. I'm going to announce you to the town council. Uh, all right. Uh, you're going to announce that you have brought with you some kind of uh, furless this small is really mutation of apes.
Huh? What are you doing? I got some Excuse achievement. Me, but no time. Gotta practice. There's a birthday party this evening at the Hairs. And I'm prepping to go. Where hey? Oh. How about a young one? The young squirrel. Have you seen Pedro the Frog by any chance? I've been waiting here for a package from the Super Squirrel Boutique for Smart Squirrels. Super Squirrel Boutique? <laughs> That's a funny name. Oh really? So what's your name? Me? I'm Jerry. Oh, I think Jerry is a very funny name. And I bet you don't make drop dead stylish accessories. Um, no. I have absolutely no idea what you're talking about. You see, I'll just keep waiting for Plato and my package then. Oh, maybe I should have left town with my cousin Edgar instead of standing here and thinking about how the crows could come back at any time. It just feels creepy, but I've just got to have my package. Well, I really wonder what those crows are doing. How about you? You pudgy animal with umbrella. What a strange looking squirrel. He looks so daring. Like he has a lot of stories to tell. Daring? No, not at all. Don't you see all these maps? What, what? Oh, so you're a map maker. Oh, m -m 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 hardly. I'm a traveler. Is this your first time in Mousewood? Oh, come and see me later at the back. Just walk up the ramp to the right of the town gate. Oh. Well, what am I doing now? I'll just leave. I promised I'd wait. You never promised anything. Hey, there is. You are again. The mouse with a backpack. Why did I have to find this um, stupid thing? Hello? Is everything okay? Is there. Is there someone behind me? I think. I've been haunted by a ghost. I, uh, I, I don't think you are. At least I don't see anybody. I can't see anyone either, but I know someone is there. You find one strange book in the woods, can't understand a single word, and then they stick you with a ghost. Isn't that just typical? I get all the luck. Okay, I'll take a look. What will I see? Oh, oh there he is! Oh, he's gone. Now he's gone! I knew it! Oh, lucky me. Oh, how liberating. What did the ghost look like? Mm, well, he had a pebble head and uh, his arms were twigged and leaves. Really? That must have been a wood sprite. I didn't think they were real. You know what? Here, take it. Oh, got myself I a book, did I? Maybe the book belongs to the wood sprite. If you see him, you can give it back to him. Oh. Uh, I thought it was cursed or something. He's Hello? not listening. I'll definitely go there, but not yet. I'm supposed to wait here. Yeah, why? Advertisement. Blue juice, tasty and blue. A quality product from the wood dwarves. The Wood Dwarves. Oh! Ah! There you are! I read an ad and he came. Come, Jerry. I want to introduce you to someone. And who is that? An owl. And an old squirrel. Hey, by the way, that owl is Kepura Gebura. Honored owl and squirrel. Ah, Jonathan. This is the rabbit I was just telling you about. Yeah. Oh, but, but that's only Dormouse. Those eyes, eyes that have seen countless worlds. Some say he knows no mercy, but my parents said he was one of the first tree walkers. I was not the first, but I knew him. Ooh, the Marquis de Hoto. I was barely knee high to a grasshopper the last time I saw you. In accordance with the tradition of the tree walkers, I hereby present you my apprentice, Jeremiah Hazelnut. I am here to request support for him so that he may learn the art of arts in these woods. Ah, magic, of course. 
I should have guessed that right away. So this Nestling is a new magician's apprentice. And we thought that the angry. of the tree walkers had been lost. Ooh What? Magician's apprentice, please hold your horse flies for a moment, Jonathan. Certainly not. Tradition demands that we immediately prepare the treetop festival. A new tree walker must be celebrated properly. According to tradition, the apprentice must make the preparations for the treetop festival alone. Nestle, before your training begins, you must send out invitations and order the blue juice and baked goods for the festival. Precisely. You should speak to Anya Mouse. She is the very best baker here in Mousewood. I shall wait for you here, Jerry. I'm interested in what's happened here. Mousewood has changed. Does that mean I'm supposed to run around out there all by myself? Yep. <laughs> I trust that you can take care of yourself. It's still summer vacation. This is your adventure, Jerry. Do you think you can do it? He is easily tricked. <laughs> what's with that smile? Absolutely. <laughs> what's with that smile of yours? Stop. Don't step on the books. Should not? somebody tidy them up? That's what I'm doing. But Conrad's niece, Urshina, keeps mixing them up again. Huh? Oh. Burn them. Anything... Oh. Okay, that isn't permanent in here. Those are basically just things I can Stylish click on, I guess. Those are the public funds of our community. Oh. Many of the town's workers prefer nuts as payment. Oh. What? I always tell people that crows cause the mess, and Ursula makes sure that it stays that way. <laughs> Okay. I always tell. Um, I can't speak to Ursula. The table. A table shaped like a three-leafed clover. The clover leaf has a special meaning for us. Oh, it symbolizes the cooperation of the three permanent members of the Mousewood Town Council. Who's the third one? Our third member is Hannah Mouse. We have not seen her since the evacuation during the last crow attack. Oh. So an owl is unable to win against a crow. How about the medic guy? What's with you? I need blue juice. Do you have any blue juice? Has a mole. Does he have blue juice? It sure smells good in here. Kind of like. Uh, this looks like blue juice. Huh? Oh. I know you're out there somewhere. Come back soon. I'll take care of your garden until then. Hmm. Oh. Valerian drops. Uli's nightcap. Sleeping drops. What? It says a bottle costs one leaf bark. Mm. I don't have any leaf barks. Not even one. I'll leave. The door is now open. I know. He left. Hey. Hey, you. This is private property. I don't care. Uh-oh. Oh. Apparently I do care. Hi. Hi. 